Fantastic Gaming The channel where Logan will show you everything From gameplay to gear, their crew is here To take you on a journey through every atmosphere Releases to news, you don't have to choose But Fantastic Gaming is here for you Hey everybody, Logan here Yeah, so I don't know if you guys had seen the last one, but I did uh, an unboxing and testing for the Insignia uh, side dock charge station thing from Best Buy, and it was for the Xbox Series S. A lot of people had questions. Some people couldn't figure it out because they're sticking in the, the battery wrong and issues of not charging and then clipping to the side. Well, helped a lot of people out on that as much as I could, but now, there's a new one and the new one is same thing but for the Xbox Series X so unlike the other one this one looks like it would clip on the bottom but we're just gonna open this up rather quickly there's no seals or anything so I'm just gonna open it right here then we're gonna attach it to my Series X and well let's let's see how it works because yeah, it shouldn't be, shouldn't be too hard. Shouldn't be, yeah. Like the other one just clipped on the side, so we're gonna, we're just gonna open it up right here because there really isn't much. Opens like that. There's your two batteries. There's your charger. your manuals you got English and Spanish we are definitely not going to be doing it in Spanish so all right now what it wants you to do is to remove the sticky and you're going to put it that way on the bottom of your Series X. We're gonna take a closer look, we're gonna put it in. I will not be putting this adhesive onto my Series X. No, because the one that I have in my game room that we're gonna try it on is my Halo Edition. We're not gonna be doing that. So the batteries are gonna most likely be the same. Yep, according to, whoops. Whoops, I dropped it. There we go. Whoop. According to, yep, yep. Okay, this one still wants you to do a little clippy thingy as well. I don't mind doing the clip, but I ain't sticking any adhesive. Yep, same as the other one. I don't know if you guys can see it. Label facing out. So now the other batteries were white. These are black, but that's gonna be the little sticker. So make sure you put the sticker facing the clip. Like, not like that. The other one had it faced that way. Let me see. Okay, so when you put it in, this side goes inward, that side out. Same thing and make sure the sticker space up. That was one of the big questions. I guess it didn't come uh, across clear enough in the previous video, but yes. So the little line out, sticker up towards the, the little thing, the little pressy thingy. I don't know what to call that. There you go. Alrighty. Oops. Hit that. Like I said, I am not putting the adhesive onto my Series X. Uh, there is a, a little clip right here. So it clips into the bottom of the vent. So let's try that out. There is my Halo Series X. I'm really hesitant on sticking this on it, but 
my other one is in the other room. Now, what this will do will act as the button right there, and it'll press the, the sync button. So you're technically just supposed to pop it in here, like that. Now you can do it like this, and I think it will be fine. I'm not going to lift up the console and stick it in, but we will take a look. And we're going to put it on its side like this. Probably not the best thing to do. Be very, very careful. Very careful. And you can see that right there. So we're going to take this and unplug it. Slide this out and it's supposed to slip that way. I don't know. That's... It has a little lip here. Up, and then because of that, the battery's popped up. All right, that goes there. Let's take the batteries out of the key. I, I keep hitting the little button. Oh no, it, it, it doesn't want to slide in while trying to put this in. Okay, it slides in that way. I'm gonna slide it. No, I don't like that. I'm not gonna do that. It, it feels like it's gonna damage it. I really don't want to do that. Uh, I wouldn't recommend doing that. It just feels unnatural, <laughs> unsafe, uh, almost damaging. Be very careful. Yeah. So, yes, you can do it if you want to. Uh, mess around with it I wouldn't recommend it I would say just stick that in there I'm not even going to connect this to this console no I just don't like the way that fits nope I, I don't like it if you don't pick this up you just can't slide it in I don't like the way that looks on this console maybe I'll put it in the other one but yeah, it's not as simple as the other one. The other one for the Series S fits a bit better. Here's my Series S. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I also don't like doing it that way either. So sorry about the weird angle. My Series S just happened to be sitting there. I'm I'm moving it. So yeah. If you have the Halo model, I wouldn't recommend it. It makes it look terrible. Maybe stick it on the regular black, but um, I, I don't like the way this fits. I don't feel safe doing it, meaning I don't feel like it's it's not going to damage it. It feels like it, it will damage the console or scratch or something. So yeah, once it plugs in, they do light up and you can charge it, but I don't think it looks good on there. Um, it's up to you whether you guys want to get it. The The other one has been completely fine on my Series S. I just want to stick the adhesive. And I want it stick that. So if you're going to do it, just going to go like that. Okay, on your standard one. If you're going to do it vertically, that's fine. Yeah. Meh. I, I'm going to give it a solid meh. So it, it's, it's up to you whether you guys want, want to get that one. I would say it's okay for charging batteries, just like the other one, but um, now after seeing it, I wouldn't recommend it. It's just, I, I don't feel, I, I, I don't feel confident that it won't damage or scratch or crack the bottom there. But hey, tell me what you guys think if you've picked it up. I wouldn't recommend it. Uh, I would say get yourself another charger or just the rechargeable batteries. Uh, unless you just want to slip it like that and just let it sit there. It's up to you. I would say no. But hey, it's $19.99 at Best Buy. Yeah, there you go. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, share this video. 
Hopefully this helped you in some sort of way. Head on over to redbandanagaming.com. Follow us on our socials. Check out our spring shop link in the description below. Like we always say, be legendary. Thanks again.